And now for more news impacting our nation and world. For the first time in the Catholic Church's history, an entire family, including a newborn baby, will be beatified. During World War II, Joseph and Victoria Olma provided refuge to eight Jewish people in their home in southeast Poland. In 1944, Nazi police surrounded their house and executed Joseph, Victoria, and their seven children, one of whom was born as Victoria was martyred. Last year, Pope Francis recognized the Olma family's martyrdom and heroic sacrifice. The Olma's beatification ceremony will take place in their hometown in Poland on September 10th. In Pennsylvania, pro-abortion Governor Josh Shapiro is cutting funding for pro-life pregnancy centers. Republican lawmakers in the Commonwealth say they want no part in the budget negotiations. The governor has decided to terminate all funding assistance for Real Alternatives, a group that allocates money to pro-life pregnancy centers throughout Pennsylvania. The spokesperson for Governor Shapiro says that cutting this life-saving funding is a move to, quote, ensure our partners are being good stewards of taxpayer resources. Over the past 30 years, the Commonwealth has given over $30 million to pro-life centers via this program. Moving forward, the clinics that have benefited from it for decades will receive nothing from the government. Eileen Artish, director of the pro-life center St. Margaret of Costello Maternity Home in Pennsylvania, says she'll keep helping women until they're down to their last penny, saying, quote, I can't imagine deserting any of them.